The desert warfare was something on its own. You just sat out there, or you moved out there, and you were exposed to everything. Past Mirza Matru, past Sidi Barani, through Halfire Pass, Rommel was pushed back, turning to fight a little every day. On November the 13th, to Churchill's great joy, Tobruk was retaken. A week later, it was Benghazi's turn to change hands for the fifth and positively final time. Mid-January 1943, Tripoli fell. A prize that had eluded O'Connor two years before. Last, the British people had something really to cheer about. And Churchill, the big victory he'd been hoping for before America would dominate the war. have altered the face of the war in the most remarkable way. I must tell you that your fame, the fame of the Desert Army, has spread throughout the world. Ah, this is not the end. Uh, it is not even the beginning of the end. Uh, but it is perhaps the end of the beginning. <laughs>